Yo, what's going on, Sexy Seven Squad? Today we're doing a ranked one v one. We're doing tilt. Uh, the reason tilt is today, I guess it's Tilawu. But the reason that it's today is because yesterday I had a doctor's appointment that I was waiting for for two months, and I also had um the patch day. So not only was Smite not up until like noon, I was also not here until two p.m. And if I uh, if I record tilt, which takes two hours, and then render it, and then upload it, which takes another, you know, few hours, uh, you wouldn't get tilt until midnight. So it's just better off if we do it this way and wait till Wednesday. Um, all right. Obviously, we go golden shark. <sighs> okay, horrific goes unbelievably hard here. But if I do get kicked in the head after I horrific him, I'm gonna scream because I can't chase him. Oh, well, actually, never mind. If I have my alt up, okay, this is the way the fight plays out. I alt him. He jumps. I dash. He kicks me. Nothing happens. I alt him. He alts me, tries to fight me. He kicks me into the wall because he's fighting me. I then dash him, horrific, and kill him. That's what it's, what's ideal for me. Get away from me. Leave me. Leave me alone. I win these. All right. All right. What are you going to do? You can do my blue in three seconds with no abilities. All right. Now what? Okay. By the way, uh, the, there is new bands for today. So, or there's new bands for this patch. So. Wait a second. You're actually committing to it? Yeah, you're not. Okay. I was making sure he wasn't. He's going to kick me. I'm just going to dash minions here. Because it actually does decent damage. His kick is down. I'm not that scared of him. Um, You have to jump for sure. You're getting owned right now. You're getting owned right now. I really don't have a lot of mana here. Oh. Alright, I need mana, dude. I really want to fight, but I need mana. The Transcendence is owning me. The Transcendence is owning me. I'm actually ahead in gold somehow. He just finished red buff, but I don't know. I don't know how, but I was ahead in gold for a second. Whatever. Just get red buff. I mean, blue buff. This is definitely going to be a game where I need to wait. Because I'm going very heavy into, into clearing with golden blade and golden shard early. And he's going straight into damage with transcendence. I could actually go transcendence dom hydra's emperor's armor. I know I just said a lot of items very quickly, so you might need to rewind and to understand what I said. Um, <laughs> that's funny. But, uh, oh. I fight here. He didn't finish an item. Oh, he got his level 5 item. That's what happened. Okay, never mind. I thought he spent his gold on, like, that weird item, but it's just a passive. He just pressed all of his buttons. I could probably fight this. There's no mana. You have no mana, and I got no problem abusing that fact. Good kill. All right, second item, dominance here. This is going to leave me a little bit open to uh, getting owned. <laughs> is a very, very nice way to put it, because... <coughs> I have no defense second item. And he's probably going to finish Transcendence and get a defensive item here. Oh, he went Dom. Okay. That's weird. <laughs> on a god that relies a lot on ability damage because of the kick and the the uh, the other thing. 
what is it called i don't i i want to call it a detonate when he like slaps his his sword down and it like catches fire but it's not a detonate okay. all right that's fine you can get scepter and i will trade you both treasure chests agreed Wait, hold on. I got it. Rock, 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 run. <laughs> I just get the scepter, pick up three rocks and dip. <laughs> ah. All right, you got no stun. I got no issue all inning you. Boss, auto. And now you're dead. <gasps> oh man oh i didn't even hear him backing all right well let's get red so i didn't get the kill even though i definitely should have like if if it was a better player they for sure get that kill there but at least i get the scepter i get the red buff i get my dominance and i get probably my blue buff i, I have a hard, really hard time believing he can win the fight now that i have dominance maybe he doesn't need the fight though i got it right, let's go do this blue now also uh super noteworthy Horrific does lower my damage because my passive is like my passive is that I gain damage based on like my next auto attack based on how much movement I do and horrific slows my movement. So it does kind of nerf my damage a little. He's going to kick me to a wall here and I'm going to be very sad. Okay, well, never mind. He kicked. He literally kicked rocks, died and surrendered. <laughs> all right nice i guess i'll see you guys in game two welcome back to game two as always we're going to be skipping skins not skipping skins we're going to be using different skins every game i don't think i'll, I'll get to all these skins um what's my next favorite skin oh you know what it's run.exe never mind obviously that was that was almost stupid that i didn't do that <clears throat> oh by the way if if you don't know, I am live, obviously, for the next probably week on uh, on Twitch right now, doing my subathon. We are on day six, day number six of the subathon. So we're doing insane shit over here. All right, horrific doesn't slow attack speed anymore. Why did I go crit? That is that is definitely that is a conquest start, and I am not conquesting right now. Um. Do I go... Okay, he so he's not slow immune. So obviously Horrific is okay. I am slow immune, so Horrific doesn't bother me much. It doesn't lower attack speed. It does lower damage output. I mean, it's still OP. It's still OP, right? It lowers movement speed by 25%, damage dealt by 10%, healing reduction by 40%, healing effective... Or shield effectiveness by 50%, and currently applied shield by 75%. Bro, it does like seven different things. An item is just overpowered. It's simply overpowered. Also, I'm getting red buff. I don't care. My man is gonna okay, never mind. I'm getting blue buff. You can have red. Don't just walk at me, man. You think he steals this? He just backflipped in mid. Okay, surely you cannot just like backflip in mid and get my blue buff. Okay. I was going to say, there's no way this guy backflips in mid, clears wave, and seals my blue. I would lose my mind. All right, can you hit me once? Oh, dickies. Wait, you're dead. No. Oh, okay. What are you doing? Bro, what are we doing here? How about you just take a bunch of minion damage? How about that? Oh, there's shell. Okay. Ow. Uh, you can't clear wave, so I am going to hit wave and then 
throw you to... Wait, you're backflipping. I'm catching. I'm throwing you back to there. Archers, own. Wait, don't, don't detonate on me. Stop. Chill out. Chill out. Don't detonate me. Stop it. <laughs> Stop it. <laughs> oh, shit. I missed. All right, you're going to backflip. Yeah. You're going to backflip. I'm going to kill this minion. Hit five and insta ult you. Never mind. You have the awareness of a goat. Not like the animal, like the greatest of all time. All right. So I guess I get blue buff and red buff here. I don't get his blue buff. I just get my blue buff and red buff. I, I think I just back. I don't think I can do anything with 300 HP and not an item. It's also going to be really hard to catch this guy all game. I think my best chance is right now. He's coming back from his blue, maybe a little bit damaged, and I fully all in him. I think that's my best bet to get a kill here. EPH. Now you backflip. Oh, man. Wait, 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 wait. Oh, dude, he ran, he ran, he ran. Okay, I can, I can maybe, I can maybe kill here with my one. Oh, so close. Okay. Okay. That didn't kill is criminal. I live in a criminal society. Oh, shit. I'm dead. Wait. Yeah, hold on. I got this, gamers. Don't worry. Don't worry. I'm cooking. Your middle tower is under attack. Oh, where'd he go? Did he just back? Okay, well, I'll take what I can. I'm gonna get these treasure chests down and oh he's gonna he's gonna invade my blue so hard. But you're gonna hit tower? I'm actually so cool if you hit tower here. I'm so okay with it, you have no idea. Because I have scepter. And this bitch heals. <laughs> Look at him go! Look at him heal. Look at the guy go. 200 HP. 300 HP. I'm just healing tower right now. Making basically his entire push useless for me. He just horn sharded. When you're as calculated as I am, it's just too easy. You know what I mean? Like, it's just too easy. He hits me with the two. Making tower aggro to him. I alt him. I toss him in. Obviously, he backflips. He's tanking tower. He's not going to stand in tower. And then I just chuck the one. I just, it's simple. It's a simple mathematics game. Geometry doo -doo 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 -doo, in the air. It's, it's too easy. All right. By the way, you're like, there's no way you ever win a fight right now. So you can just run away if you want. Um, I do want that red buff. Pow, pow. Meow. Uh, okay, so one bad thing about this matchup is he easily outsecures me with any buff that he wants to contest. Alright. Uh, I'm just gonna back here. I need to reset that. I'm not gonna go for his blue because I feel like I'll never get it. Um, I'm thinking right here I go Envenomed Executioner and then just Demon Blade and uh, Deathbringer. 
Now, crit did get nerfed kind of heavy, but it should be fine. All right, he's got no backflip. Maybe I can kill here. He's going to alt me. Still no backflip, probably. I missed because I'm garbage. Oh. All right. I mean, that that's his everything. That's his alt. He might still have shell up, but like, you take way too much damage. All right. Shell and horn shard. I'm just like, I'm just like milking him, dude. He's got nothing left. I could dash on him right now, but, and I, I think I could kill him. But it is a little risky. So I'm just going to get this first. Help me with my murderous endeavors. I'll grab this. I'm just, I'm just a little farming maniac, dude. Oh, hello. I'm a farming maniac. He backed, which gives me time to just clear this wave for free. No danger of death. And Venom's XE is with like 2400 after you have tier one, 2200 after you have tier one. Okay, that is that is criminal that you would do that. Wait, I'm just gonna get my blue buff. You know what? You stop my back, fine. I'm down. You wanna, you wanna fight me again? You wanna hit me again? You wanna see how that works out? You wanna play that game again? It worked out so well for you last time, huh? I missed. I have no mana for my two. If my if I have my two, this guy dies so easy right now, but I don't have my two. Alright, now I have my two. Now you backflip. Now I simply dodge the one with a right juke. Because he because he he favors left. Okay, now I simply punch him in the head a bunch. It is too easy. A right juke because he favors left. Go back. In it venom. And slap a blink on. Fuck it. And now he just gets owned. Like he had full breastplate last game or last fight. And more HP and more cooldowns. And I still beat him in the fight. Because I know every dude, I know everything that he's going to do before he knows he's gonna do it. Example. I can simply walk at you, I'm pretty sure. I think I died. Fuck. Alright, tankier than I thought. Tankier than I thought. Oh, that's why. Not tankier than I thought. Backflip faster than I thought. I get two more hits on him before he backflips with only 20% cooldown and then I get dual orb and then he dies. But he got Jotuns. I really don't want to just like alt to red, but I know it's already gone. It's just the hope in my eyes diminishing, really. If he if he plays aggro after blue, I kill him. Of course, right when I cancel, dude. Dude, fuck COD timing. It's my it's my timing. It's my timing, dude. Right when I cancel the alt. What a fucked up day. I actually thought he would be doing this. He just keeps giving me the scepter, by the way, which you should not do. I've gotten like an extra 600 gold this game just from scepter. I've gotten it like like eight times. 
Okay, that's 400 gold. Never mind. I've got an extra 400 gold. Oh, uh, no. He said his backflip's down. Yo, okay. He's really tanky right now, gamers. So he is gone with the upgraded breastplate, which is, if you don't know, an extra 21 protection. It's an extra 21 physical protection. I lied. It's an extra 20 physical protection and magical, technically. But in duel, it's just physical. Um, so I don't know if I can kill him. You can backflip. That that is a thorns. That's a thorns play. I'm gonna do that, and then I'm gonna blink. I don't want to take extra hits. Um, dude, I'm getting I'm getting owned by DR right now. Literally, my three did no damage because of DR. But I, I needed to blink in that fight because if I walked in and took the extra tower shots, I just die. The thorns play is wild. It's not bad per se because you know I'm a melee assassin who needs to punch in the head to do damage, so it makes a lot of sense. But I still hate it. Uh, I can't get this, so I'm just gonna take like half of it and then do this. Oh, he altered. What the hell? Oh, your blue's not up. I mean, you can chase me if you want. I don't think you ever kill me here. That, that is my scepter. Thank you. There's no universe I give you that scepter. I'm sorry. Yeah, you can start my red buff for me if you want. I'm cool with that. Oh, man. Can you backflip? Thank you. Oh, never mind. He walked forward instead of backwards. He walked forward instead of backwards. What a gamer. He Wait, he didn't pick up Duel Orb. I guess he doesn't need it. He's so tanky. His one did 600 damage. With the detonation. I guess it was an auto attack plus his one that did 600. His one just did 500. Um, I probably need Serrated. I could get tier two, but there's no point. I'm only 300 gold out. I just go farm for it, grab serrated. And then... I really don't see what he can do to me. Like, these fights he's quote-unquote winning are all because I'm diving tower or staying with 300 HP. Going for outplay. If I just, if I just play simple as hell, all in, if I don't kill him back and do it again, like, he can't win a fight. I also could just alt Phoenix and take it. Um. He's getting more defense, dude. That's okay. All right, I'm just going to go dominance then. I could... Oh, okay. He's backed. That is a free bull demon for me. Standing back there. So we go to the right here because obviously you put that thing on the left. I don't really care if he hits me. All I want to do is get Phoenix. Um. And then he's double defense with like an upgraded defensive too. So that's 70 protection and that's 50 protection. So this dude is tanky as fuck. He has 200 physical prots. So I think I just go dominance. Dominance is 2400, right? 25, okay. 
I thought dominance was 100 gold cheaper than uh, transcendence. But I guess not. Um, I could just back and wait 100 gold, to be honest. There's nothing on the map that I can do until I have dominance. Fuck it. We'll just wait for it. I'm a thousand gold up still. Uh, okay. If he ever pushes up to about here, I can all in Titan with alt and do probably two to three thousand damage before he even like has a chance to kill me. He's staying very far back. I'm just going to go for it. We horrific, so his damage output is lower. Toss the thorns and run, so thorns doesn't own me. Okay, blink me. Again, he favors the right, but he's going to try to get my thing off, so I'm just going to keep juking. All right, now you backflip. Titan has taken 3,000 damage. And I am completely fine with that. I am completely fine with that. Like I said, about 3,000 damage before I have to run. And I can just do that again and win the game. I can just all in next time, actually. Because I don't think he can kill me fast enough. He's double defense. He really doesn't do that much damage. Actually, you know what I can do? I don't even have to wait for alt. I can fire blink that bitch. Fire blink is OP. This item owns. I go here. I dash here. I blink here. Or I just dash past him and blink. All right. I thought he'd be playing more defensive, but he just was standing there. <laughs> All right. I'll see you guys in game number three. What's up, gamers? Game three. I'm fighting Chris. He came to chat. He said he got prio queued five times, which is Omega unfortunate. But at least we get a really good game. Chris, the GM versus Sam, the GM. I mean, we're on totally different levels. I'm way better than this guy, but you know, I guess I'll give him some spotlight. I'm trolling. I love Chris. Um, by the way, if you haven't checked out Chris, he does stream, I think, every day other than Sunday, maybe. He either takes Saturday or Sunday off, but he streams every day, eight hours a day. And mainly focuses on duel. So if you guys want some duel content, you can definitely go hang out with him. Uh, Awilix is slow immune in her alt, which means horrific is not very good when we all in. Which actually means I'm going to take a level three thorns because it does 100 base damage. Which at this level is like kind of a fuckload. It does 100 base damage plus percentage of damage taken. And you get 15% damage mitigation during it. So I actually think I just kind of dumpy on him. I can do a maximum of 25% of his health with thorns. If he ever jumps on me, I insta pop thorns. He uses his two. And then I think he just blows up. I have a, I have a really hard time believing he doesn't explode from thorns. I mean, he might shell to be honest. And Shell might be able to save him. Did he go red or did he go blue? I wasn't paying attention. He went blue. That's good for me. Look at that. Look at that. 100 damage, dude. Look at that tech. Look at that thorns tech, man. The instant 100 damage. I just owned him. I owned him. He's dead. He's deceased. He's never going to live. He's never going to work in this town again, dude. All right. We got the minis, which means I hit level 5 off this wave here. I'm waiting for him to use his 2, and then I missed. Wait, I can still hit 5 here and kill him, though. Ow.
Oh, you owned me. You actually just owned the shit out of me. You owned the shit out of me. I've been owned. Wait, you might be owned here. He died to archers. Chris, you're not supposed to die to archers. We're two GMs here, okay? If GMs, fighting GMs, die to archers, you know how much shit we're going to get talked? Oh, no. I can see the comments already. The best dual players still die to minions? <laughs> Fuck me, man. Chris, you can't do that. That's mine. I will kill you. I will kill you. I'll kill you so dead it's insane. Leave. Leave me. Leave me immediately. Okay, wait. Hold on. You're going to kill me. You're going to kill me dead. Okay. You ulted? That was not allowed. That was actually super rude. Actually, that was so rude that I think I'm going to tell your wife. I'm going to tweet at your wife after this game. And I'm going to say that Chris is acting like a little Tamlin in the duel scene. You need, you need to you need to put some fucking respect on his name. I'm actually going to go. Oh, what are you building? Breastplate? Yeah. So I'm going to go Transcendence here and I'm going to play slow. I'm going to play slow. He's probably going to his blue. He could do it. He could do mine, but... Okay. I don't really think that all did anything for him. I think he just kind of wasted all. Because, like... He, did, he didn't kill me, obviously. And unless he steals my blue, he didn't get any pressure off of that. But he didn't steal my blue. But he got hit by that. Uh, he does have alt this time, but he knows he can't win this fight. And I should be able to get red. He doesn't have blink or anything. Right, jump away. I'm cool with this. I'm cool with this. Double buff control. Double buff control. What about the Chesters? Nice. Double buff control, Scepter, and Chesters. I am... I've never been happier. The best start. I could go Hydras and Crit Chance, actually. You know what? That sounds really fun. Obviously, this is a dipshit build, and you should never do this. But it does sound fun. And if I lose to Chris, I'm okay with it, so... Nice try, poo poo head. How do you stop when you can't even see? But I kind of hurt you a lot. I feel like I kind of hurt him like way too much, actually. All right, he ulted too, so I'll take it. I really want that. His ult is down. But he's so fucking tanky, man. Oh, he's med too. I think I'm just dead here. Oh, but I turned. But I turned, man. Okay, that that's a smite two moment for sure. That one's a smite two moment. Uh, 
Um, no defense and going crit is like the craziest dual strat I've ever seen. Of course, I'm the dumbass who does it. He's going Titan's Bane? No, he's going Crusher. Obviously. I might be able to steal his blue. Almost. I had to go for it, you know? He also had to go for it. It's a rule. That did so much damage to me, actually. Okay, Thorns owned him. He had to he had to stop hitting me because Thorns would have completely obliterated him. Um. So he had to he had to stop hitting me, and then I just get a free free big damage. Free big damage. This doesn't have pen on it anymore. Oh, it does have pen. It, it lost its attack speed. Dude, that was such a big buff for Mercury, by the way. I know a lot of people don't know that, like, Mercury wasn't able to throw his one over walls before. In order, like, you had to actually have vision of them to hit them with your one before. And the, the buff to make it so you can throw your one over walls is actually a huge buff. When did they change it? It, it happened, happened a long time ago, like a year and a half ago or something. But it's a buff that I don't think anyone's ever really talked about. And it's so good. I have crit, so I'm not very scared of him. Okay, well, I am if I fuck up everything. Oh, never mind, because I just hydro crit him for 300. Getting a Hydra script for 300 is crazy. Um, Scepter in a second. Yeah, he's so low HP. I don't think he can, he can fight me at all here. Crit. Oh, uh, bummer. If my one crits on any of those hits, I'm like definitely diving. I think his blue is up very soon. All right, blue buff for me. Oh, he's going crit as well. Oh, this is gonna be a this is gonna be a battle to the death. This is gonna be a battle to the death, gamers. Be prepared. I'm gonna go boomerang. Boomerang and then Deathbringer. Damn, I even altered for that. Dude. The crit. The crits, man, I'm telling you. I ulted because I didn't want him to get red buff, but he was he was waiting for it. I definitely get Phoenix here, right? I do a lot of damage. Oh, he has blink, maybe not. I get it. Three hundred damage on the one. That is so hard to like fight into. You're getting poked out so so often. I'm a scepter main. I will give up XP camp for scepter ten out of ten times. I am deceased. I'm a I'm a dead main. 
Nice. Nice. So, <clears throat> if you're wondering why he didn't get thrown when I when I threw when I threed him, okay. it's because you're knock up immune with um a wheel exalt. So he just he just stays in the same place. I can't. I mean, I could probably hit Titan a little bit, but he is a scary man to to dive too much. Uh, 2,900 gold is Deathbringer, but 3,500 is the good Deathbringer. Uh, I'm just going to wait it out. And I'm going to go Aegis as well. He got Demon Blade. He took a lot of damage from that Fire Minion wave. All right. I want his blue and then the bull demon. I miss. I do no damage. I need Deathbringer. I mean, I have 3,500 gold in hand. Do you think he just sprints over here, or do you think he clears wave? Okay, he clears wave, which means this is for free. I actually really want that red buff. Very good, gamers. Very good. I had to use my thorns there in order to secure Scepter, but totally worth it. And we get the good Deathbringer. And I'm just going to go 500 pot instead of a tier 1 item. And my crit chance is now 84%. But with Bladed Boomerang procs, it goes up a lot. And then uh, I'll be at 100% after a couple autos. Oh my god, I three hit him. I three hit him. Holy crap. Alright, well. Deathbringer. Deathbringer plus Hydras does so much damage. I literally autoed him for 600 and he has defense. Like, that was... That was crazy. Alright, GG, I'll see you guys in the next game. What's up, boys? Game number four. Uh, this guy only banned four things and then passed the rest of his ban. And now, now he is playing Gilgamesh. Is this the same guy? It's a different Gilgamesh. So I'm fighting two different Gilgameshes. I feel like in duel, there's going to be a lot of Gilgamesh because Gilgamesh is really strong right now. And um, he just got unbanned in duel. So you're going to be fighting a lot of them. And they are pretty hard to fight. So... A little spooky, spooky, scary skeleton. I'm going to read chat YouTube if you guys want to come over here and, and hang out with me. I'm just going to read real quick a question while we wait for the buff to spawn. Would Soul Eater Hydra's Fail Not Crusher Heartseeker Mannequin's Hidden Blade on Nut be good or am I crazy? That sounds terrible. To be honest. You only have... You have one crit item... And you have 20% pen. So you have 30% pen. You have 30% pen. 10%. Hold on. Maybe I maybe I, I went too soon. That build, you have 20% cooldown. 30% pen. And one crit item. The mannequin's hidden blade is not good. Like, you should never go Hidden Blade on Nut. Or on many gods, realistically.
And he got red buff, which is unfortunate for me. Also just got owned. How did he le hit level four? That fast. Oh, he's on Devos. And he got blink. Holy shit, this guy wants to kill me. Wait, this guy wants to actually murder me. I have to play very careful. If I can clear backline and he jumps on me, I'm down to take the fight. All right. You're on that blue buff shit. You have no man at all. Wait, I get this. Nice. He was so greedy. So greedy, dude. I get double buff. Um, he could kick me into tower here, but I mean, then he can't clear. And I don't think he kills me. He wants to get the gold, so I'm just going to sit here and I'm not going to let him get that. I'm not letting him get the gold. So greedy. So greedy, dude. You're going to stand there and back while I'm charging my ult at you and you have that much HP. I'm not letting that slide. No universe I let that slide. I don't care if I'm the one that dies. I'm ulting you there 10 out of 10 times. The level of disrespect. He's going to kick me away. Wait, I want this. Thank you. <laughs> all right horrific down nope all right well <clears throat> there's his alt down and i could maybe uh i could maybe kill him you lazy backed two times in a row and died both times how dare you how dare you Some people never learn, man. Some people never learn, man. I'm going to double pop pots here because I really want that red buff. And I need to clear wave in order to get it. Which means I need to tank wave in order to get it. Okay. She just blink kicked me for 200 damage. He's tanking the whole wave, so that, that does not work. By the way, if he goes for that, I kill him. Yeah, he's backing up. All right. Now, my blue is up, but by leaving it up... Um, like I can I can leave it up right now because I get to keep pressure on the map. Both with the scepter and his blue buff. He might try to kick me out of this. If he does, I'm just gonna toss him. Never mind. I can't toss him because his kick went a lot faster than I thought. Yeah, vital. Oh no, that was probably his item pickup. Alright, fuck it. Didn't want to have to ult, but whatever. I'm not backing. I'm not scared of you. Trust me. We have to fall back. Okay, I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm scared. I'm a bitch. All right. Let's get berserkers. Um and then Xe. Actually, I'm down to just go serrated here, probably. IIRC means if I remember correctly or if I recall correctly. Basically, do you remember? All 
right, I'm gonna take a lot of damage here. But I did just finish my Berserkers, so like maybe it's fine. Ouch. That wall hurt me. Um I think if I just get serrated here, he can't really do much, right? I need to look for Chesterfields. I don't know where the chesties are. I have found the Chesterfields. But what are the odds that he comes and kicks my ass right now? Because he definitely could have killed me. Oh, there he is. Okay. That was his blink alt for just my blink. Or that was his blink and alt for just my alt. Which I will take. That's not up. Do you think he knows red spawning right now? My guess is no, because he's not here. Nice. Nice, dude. Okay, that is not a good play. He probably took so much damage from that that he can't even defend his own tower because he had the back. Okay, he took no damage from that, apparently. Doesn't matter. You did Bull Demon and I took your tower. You can chase me if you want. If you get no minions, you can't take tower. Actually, even if you get minions, you can't take tower. You know, peace out, gamer. Peace out, gamer. You got Bull Demon at the, the price of your own tower. And I'm, I'm also like 99% sure if he tries to take my tower, he just dies. Because I have serrated now and I have, I have pen. My next item is probably executioner because he does have devos. So he is healing a lot and you get extra healing from, um, your jump on Gilgamesh. I don't know if a lot of, like a lot of people don't know that, but it does give you a lifesteal buff. So... Um, <clears throat> are these up? These are up. I miss. There's no way you think you win this, right? Okay, wait a second. I killed myself. Wait a second. Why is he that tanky? Fucking failings 20. Oh my god. I'm so stupid. He wins that because failings not only gives you 30% attack speed, it gives you an extra 21 protection. So I should have gone XE first. That was just an oversight. Like that fight, I actually win that fight if that's like a Berserkers or something. But because it's Phalanx and I overlooked the extra protections he got, I just got shit on. Ouch. I'm pretty sure I cannot get this. Yo, he does actually so much damage to me. Is your blue up? No, it's not. Okay. Well, red is up. I also think that Devos that he has is doing way more than I initially thought. So I have to go and I have to get... I have to get Envenomed. What a sexy weapon. I mean, at the same time... Like, at the same time, me dying there sucks assholes. I'm still, like, 900 gold up. Well, I'm 800 gold up. And I'm still up a tower, too. So, even though that death there was, like, super shitty. And it's only shitty because, like, it's a death I could have prevented easily. But, um... 
Are you gonna jump on me? Yeah, you are. It's all right. Those are down. 184. That is not a lot of damage. Okay. Now I have Envenomed. I can probably fight. His ex his Kins isn't going to do shit. I only have 1900 health. I tried to cancel his jump with my ult there. All right, he's just gonna back. I think I might just full commit X. Um, I might full commit Bull Demon here. I don't know if I do enough damage to full commit, but fuck it. I'm actually gonna use Thorns too. I'm gonna tank this for more Thorns damage because I don't know how much time I have. Um, going Toxic Blade. We're just gonna start some crit chance now. I should pick up that blue, probably. No, nah, I mean, Red Buff is gonna spawn kind of kind of soon, kind of shortly. I just wait on it. Uh, it will be hard to fight him. To be honest. Alright, I stopped his two there. Okay, apparently it doesn't stop his two. Uh, I'm dead here. I really... I thought that... I thought if I caught his, his kick with my three, it would stop it. But it actually just... It stops it, but then it, it doesn't put it on cooldown. Which is omega fuck. All right, I need to go get Phoenix, though. He doesn't think I'm a threat on this Phoenix. I guess he's right. Damn it. I mean, actually, I can ult that. How much health did I have? Like 200? That's really easy to kill. Ow, ow, ow. I could just simply ult it. Oh, well... When you know they're going to blink, it's pretty easy to juke it. So. I have crit too. Actually, I have everything up. Alright, Phoenix down. That's really good. He's going crit chance too. I mean, it's psychotic. I'm just going to go Deathbringer last item. Um, I think my build definitely beats his. It's actually not even close. Maybe not right now, but once Deathbringer's online. Okay, that missed. That's tragic. All right. All right. My horrific down. But I think it's fine. I look like his kin says nothing, man. Only 53 damage and three hits. That means his kins is adding like, I don't know, somewhere around 17 damage a hit. Basically nothing. I'm going to go 500 pot here and I'm going to full alt him because I have thorns and he doesn't have his crit yet. He might be able to get crit. 
But we will see. Oh, I'm so slow. Alright, well, let's just do some damage here then. I'm probably just gonna, like, full dive it. I mean, I think I die here, but... Oh, no, I live here. Whoa, dude, living there is crazy. Living there is so crazy. I did so much damage to Titan. Oh, hi, baby. No. Don't judge me on my purchases, okay? Yeah. Okay. Uh but yeah, I was gonna I was gonna full dive that Titan. But <laughs> I I saw an opportunity to maybe get away and live, and the fact that it worked is ridiculous. So now, hello. Okay. I mean, those stuns hurt, man. Oh, so close. So close. All right, I ult Titan here. He has to defend Phoenix from minions. So ulting Bull Demon here is, um, it's just going to give me the freedom to do it for free. I could have ran there, but by wasting the time running here, I would have gotten, uh, probably invaded. Okay. There's this fire blink down, I guess. Nice. Nice. The thorns kill, baby. The thorns kill. Nice. Dude, when he missed Blink, I think he knew he lost the game. Which is unfortunate for him, but like... It just happens that way sometimes. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you guys in the next game. Oh my god, what is happening, gamers? Oh no. It's a Masters Border Mercury Mirror match. My eyeball. Um, I don't, I don't know how to play this matchup, to be honest. I don't know how to play this matchup. Um, all right. Let's game, let's game, let's game. I kind of think I go transcendence here. Cause like, do I need, do I need golden blade? Tools of the trade. I'm going to try something new this game. I'm going to go transcendence, dominance, hydras and emperor's armor and be a cringe backdoor. I want to see if it, if I own with it. I feel like my damage is going to be fucking nuts. Like, actually crazy high. I also think he's starting red buff.
Nice try. Nice try, dude. Dude, look at that. He never even hit me. It did 115 damage. I think I die here. Yeah. Damn. 20 power, 5 movement speed. 20 power, no movement speed. He does a lot of damage. I even hit him with thorns. How did I lose that? Just because I tanked so much damage from blue buff, I guess. That's crazy. Blue buff kind of owned me, huh? All right, well, I guess we're on the recovery now. I should be able to get this buff for free now. Mm. He actually just got a level 5 off a of minion, which is so criminal. This game has just been Omega unlucky right now. Oh, so unlucky, so unlucky. I really feel like my build is going to be better later, though. Like, Golden Shard early game, obviously better. But... I, didn't think I, I don't know. I feel like... I feel like I'm going to be so hard to fight later. Hmm. But I do have to stop like losing everything. Oh, I missed that for real, dude. If I hit that one, he died. That's so criminal. Let's go, Hydras. I don't want to lose my blue here. Nice. Nice. All right, that gets me back in the game really well. It puts me back in the game very, very well. He's going defense. So obviously, I'm not going to want to fight him. The reason I think Transcendence is so good here, by the way, is because um, Golden Shard is so strong. Hold on. I, I win this fight really easy. If I just keep aggression on him. If he has ult, I die here. Yeah, he does. Speak the one or, or die. Nice. nice. <clears throat> Just gonna back here. He could potentially blink dash me. So healy. He has so much HP. Your middle tower. Final order. Us. Oh, he pulled it away. That's fine. 
I'm just gonna back. I didn't think I could get any stronger. Um really not much I can do here. I could alt and try to steal his blue, but I can't. He's gonna clear it too quick. <clears throat> this is all about just trying to stay even for a couple levels. Like until we're like level 16 or something and we have like three or four finished items. It's all about staying even. Oh. Mm. He's got to finish Berserkers. I can't fight that. Ouch. That reached me. Wait, how did he get the, the scepter? He blinked past me, bro. All right, I'm going to go Phalanx here. This looks thick enough to repel a kunai. Phalanx is better than Berserkers in this matchup because obviously all of the damage they're doing is basically just auto attacks. I don't really know what I want second relic though. I feel like Thorns is very, very good for me here. And obviously, once Transcendence gets fully stacked, it has 10 base pen on it, which is really nice. Yeah. I'd have to be an idiot to fight him right now, so I'm not going to. I will poke him whenever I get the chance, but... Oh, I suck. Nice. Just gonna alt the wave. Get the timer on the red buff. I'm just trying to damage him a little bit. This is really good though, actually. Oh, he's gonna ult the red. He's gonna ult the wave here, I think. Uh, actually, it'd be kind of useless. I did that really fast. Uh, let's grab Phalanx. That was a big swing for me. He doesn't have a second relic yet either. Um, oh, he went Hydra's too. Okay, so Hydra's is the backdoor item, by the way. You want to go Hydra's and Dominance and obviously Amp Armor. I am definitely much tankier than you are. So I'm okay with this. And I just finished my transcendence, which is awesome. Your blue up, blue is not up. Oh, uh, he does have alt, but I also have alt, so I'm chilling. He's probably gonna. Well, he can't actually alt me here, can he? Because the rock protects me. My blue is up. I thought my blue was down. That's super nice. Hello. Oop. Little Hydra's poking. He's gonna all through me probably. Yeah. Yeah, this Phalanx is uh, kind of carrying me right now. Phalanx is doing very well. Time to get serious. Yeah. 
And then I guess dominance next item. He's also going dom next item, by the way. So we're going to have, like, even though I tried to go a very different build than him, he is trying really hard to make sure we have the same fighting potential. Also, I'm going to, I'm going to pay to upgrade my thorns here because every basic attack from enemy gods reduces my cooldown. So my thorns will be up very often, like every fight, basically. Ouch. You have to dash away, gamer. You do not win these. I missed. Oh, I killed myself here, I think. Yeah, he sold his Berserkers for Phalanx also. Okay. He really wanted the red buff. And also thought that he would hit me. But when I hear the Charging Mercury, I'm not just going to stand in the way. So that's a tower down. And that's also a wasted red buff for him. And a blue buff for me. And not only is that a blue buff for me, and a kill, and the tower, it's also dominance. I didn't think I could get any and I could go Emp Armor now. I'm going to wait it out a second and I'm going to go Serrated and I want to see what he builds. So because I went Transcendence and I took the L for the early clear, he has Golden Blade and I have Transcendence and I'm doing so much more damage than him, it's unbelievable. What's up, gamer? All right. Exactly. Exactly. Big win. I steal fire. He surrenders. And the Masters Border Mercury Mirror Match goes down. GG. See you guys in the next game. What's up, gamers? This is going to be the last Mercury game of the video because we've been recording for two hours now. There was a game in between because uh, I needed to play Apollo to fight somebody because they banned Mercury. It was it was the it was the Masters board of Mercury from last game. He didn't want a mirror match, I guess. Again, Kitten Tobin. <laughs> okay, now either Kitten Tobins is about to roll my shit or get rolled. There is no in between. There, there's there's no way that this person is not a smurf. They're either going to slap me or going to get slapped. There is there is no in between. No possibility. 2700 MMR on Mr. Tobeans. A little terrifying. Uh, I kind of want to put 2 points in my in my one this game mm. no I'll keep it simple I'll keep it simple Long time fan. Good luck. Have fun, bro. Oh, thank you so much. Thank you so much, Kitten Tobeans. All right, a little blueby. A little blueby start. Are you... Um, a red buff starter or a blue buff starter? You are a blue buff starter. Which bodes well for me. Get the minis. I'm very scared. 
Medusa's burst damage is unbelievably high. Okay, his dash is down. You have dash up. Oh, good shell. Good shell. I can't even be mad. That was a solid shell. If he hits five, he turns the corner and ults with this, this red buff. All right. He did just hit five. Let's clear. We'll grab our golden blade. Um, arguably the best play right now is to get that before I back. And then meet my wave at tower. Hey, but I'm just going to do it this way. Just because I'm a little scared of the, the plays he might make. By the way, my horrific counters his shell. Because not only does it take 75% away if I use it after he shells. But also makes it 40% worse if I use it before he shells. So it's just good overall. Okay. Captain never miss an auto over here. Excuse me, sir. That's mine. Damn. Okay. All right. Ouch. That altered me for 200 damage with only Griffin Wing and while I'm looking away from it. That's absurd. That's what I'm saying, man. Mercury's or not Mercury. Medusa's burst is so good. Like it's so it, I think she has probably one of the strongest bursts out of every hunter in the game other than like a triple bounce Hoi. And yes, that does include on her. The dash, if you auto attack, dash and then auto attack again cuz your your dash is an auto cancel technically, then you can do like 3 to 4 autos plus dash damage plus the damage from your 1 and your 2 within like 2 seconds. It's so incredibly strong. He's definitely going to invade me, I think, here. Oh, no. He's not invading. I'm going to just test if I can invade him. Fuck it. So close. So close. Uh, Medusa's only damage types. I guess she has her her two and her ult as well. Watch out. Oh, there's a treasure chest somewhere else. Look at that burst. Look at that burst. I just lost 600 health in like a quarter of a second, man. Oh my god. Her burst is insane. Now she might not get red buff here because I am healthy. Okay, I'm no longer healthy. And in fact, I'm in range of being dead. Dude, that god is so dumb, man. Look at that. Look at that. Witness. Holy crap, man. What a dumb god. I don't even get to play the game, dude. Oh, yeah. I don't even get to play the game. I have to go crit. 
I think I actually have to go crit. I don't want to go crit this game. But I don't have a choice. I will get owned if I if I don't. Okay, I'm just I'm just dead. I'm Cool, dude. Eight auto attacks in one and a half seconds. This looks like it hurts. I'm just always dead. All right, if Phalanx, Phalanx needs to carry me here. Okay. Um, do you think he steals this? No. Are these up? Yes. All right. That's big for me. That's big for me. Double buffs there. Hey, sometimes fish just won't cut it. Dude, I'm down 700 gold already. And I've died once. Gonna heal my tower up with this. Nice. Nice. Red buff is mine. Oh, he's dead here. He's dead here. I full 360. Oh my god. Oh my god. I almost got so cringed on. I have to I have to I have to go. I have to fight. Uh, he's dashing away. I cannot believe I got stunned. All right, here's Aussie. I'm going in Venom. Um, my build is so incredibly far behind his. I don't even know how to explain it. I've had to buy potions to even clear wave. He has not bought potions or bought glyphs. He he can per potentially have a full like a full extra item here. Okay, well, because I can't do anything about that. So he's going XE for sure here. He's not going to go Kins. That'd be a bad play. Just poke him a little bit. You think he invades this blue? I think no, but you never know, I guess. Um, I don't win this fight at all, huh? Okay. Okay. Even with Envenomed ex uh, Executioner and Phalanx, I just get owned that hard. He does twice as much damage as me. That is a play. 
I suppose. I dude, I'm useless. I can't play. That God's OP. Like, uh, I can't even. I don't even get that fun, man. Okay, he did that. He, d he definitely did that on purpose. There's no way he ever thinks he wins that fight. Going down 800 gold means you're down one item. No, the fact that I'm down 800 gold and also the fact that I've spent 400 on potions means it's 1200. And then the fact that I've spent 600 on a glyph when he has not means that I'm down almost 2000 gold from a fighting standpoint. Ooh, this looks like it hurts. All right, so let's go. I mean, with Demon Blade, maybe I can get some lucky crits and get a, get another like cringe kill here. It would actually help me so much if I could. Neither of us have relics. Come on, show up, dude. Watch out. Let's go. All right, he just ulted. I mean, I could try this. He has no ult. And I do have some crit chance. Maybe. Okay. That's pretty big. That is pretty big. Deathbringer next. You got Demon Blade. I cannot fight him. Deathbringer is so expensive. Uh, do I just maybe try to get Phoenix anyways? Let's go. Yeah, he's just hanging by his phoenix. Yeah, I got stuck on minions. That sucks. I'm just dead here. Oh, I'm just dead here. Okay. Okay. Well, there goes my Phoenix, I guess. He has he has Demon Blade and crit 8 out of 11 autos. Man, I'm going to throw my computer out a window. Holy shit. I'm so mad right now. I'm actually so tilted. I, I'm... Uh, I don't know. I don't know. There's nothing I can do, man. I actually can't play the game. Hey, sometimes this just won't cut it. And his RNG on fucking just Demon Blade is the dumbest thing I've ever seen. The luckiest player to ever grace the the battlegrounds of Smite.
You're getting what did you get? Deathbringer? Oboe? I can't, dude. I don't know what I'm supposed to do here. That took everything I had, and he still almost won. He almost won that fight. After all that. Watch out. I mean, I don't know. Maybe when I get serrated, things will change a little. Because I'll have some sustain. Perhaps. I do think his oboe play is bad, which is like my saving grace here. I'm pretty sure. I want him to use abilities on that. Oh, okay. Or he just knows I'm there somehow. How does that miss? Alright. I think he just walks in and takes Phoenix here. Your middle yep. Phoenix is under attack. Your middle Phoenix has been destroyed. Thank you, baby. All right. Um, watch out. He yeah, got spectral. Hold Obo for spectral. Watch out. I can't crit him. I got 30 seconds left on on fire actually. Your Titan is under attack. My Titan is getting on. Destroyed a middle enemy phoenix. Red buff might spawn for me here. Oh, this is so bad. This is so bad. Hurry, hurry, hurry. Okay. He took his time coming over here. Thank goodness. If I can get my blue buff, I can get a 3k pop for the last fight.
Okay. Okay. All right. I'm six items. I'm 500 pot. I'm red buff and I'm 3k pot. If I do not explode this man when I land an alt, I don't know what else to do. A little boost for later. Go with it. Let's take it down. Go with it. Mm. I missed. I need my cooldowns up before I all in. He's gonna circle around maybe. Crap, dude. Watch out. Ugh. I'm actually tilted still. I'm actually still tilted. Like, I... I I landed everything and I won the game and I had the better, the better build. I had the 500 pot. I had the red buff. I had the three K pot. I knew everything. I did everything good and I'm still tilted. Oh my goodness gracious, dude. You know, I actually think, you know, you know what I'm going to say? I think he, he lost himself the game by building spectral. I think if he kept his oboe, or just went Deathbringer, like I did, he wins the game for free. If he goes Oboe or Deathbringer, I get, I just get owned, dude. I just get absolutely owned. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, guys, peace.